Gingivitis is the Latin term for an acute or chronic inflammation of the gums. Healthy gums, as pictured here, are pale pink, tightly attached to the teeth, and, when looked at closely, have a certain pattern, similar to an orange. By contrast, inflamed gums almost always lose this pattern, swell up, bleed easily, and turn dark red, as seen in this movie. In most cases, gingivitis does not cause pain. In a general sense, all bacteria found in the mouth flora can cause gingivitis. Another possible cause is Escherichia coli. Non-treated gingivitis can turn into periodontitis. You can find out more about that in the video by the same name. Overall, the most common cause of inflammation of the gums is plaque. There's more about this topic in the video plaque. Subsequently, it's very important to remove plaque thoroughly from the teeth surface. However, you will not be able to do this if you have overhanging fillings, leaking fillings, overhanging bridge or crown edges, or if you have interlacing teeth caused by crowded teeth, for example. In order to prevent any further gum inflammation, the dentist has to work thoroughly and carefully and clean the teeth well. If your gums still become inflamed, they can bleed quite heavily for a short time. However, this should not be taken as an acceptable excuse. You still have to continue brushing them. Many people with red or inflamed gums stop cleaning their teeth because they're afraid of the blood. However, this causes more plaque and can be the beginning of a vicious cycle. Hence, good mouth hygiene represents both treatment and prophylaxis against plaque-associated gum inflammation, also known as gingivitis.